Dear students, I welcome you all to this problem solution series in digital electronics. I am solving the problems from the book Digital Design by Maurice Mano and Michael Siledi. So in this video, I am solving the problem number 4.27 from the chapter number 4. The problem is a combinational circuit is specified by the following Boolean functions. We are given with three Boolean functions. Okay, this is the sum of mean terms expressions. Then we have to implement this circuit with a decoder constructed with NAND gates and NAND or N gates connected to the decoder outputs okay that means we have to use a decoder along with NAND gates and NAND or N gates connected to the decoder outputs use a block diagram of the decoder and minimize the number of inputs in the external gates now before drawing the decoder we will have to express these functions given expressions or given boolean functions in terms of NAND expressions so f1 equal to f1 of a comma b comma c equal to sum of 3 5 6 so this is nothing but this 3 means a bar b c plus this 5 means a b bar c that means 1 0 1 this is 0 1 1 okay this is 1 0 1 this is 4 plus 1 this is 5 plus this is 6 then a b c bar this is one one zero so this is the expression now we have to express it in terms of nand gates so what we'll do we will take two times complement if we take two times complement the terms will be the same okay now let us break the inner complement what we'll have a bar b c whole complement into a b bar c whole complement into a b c bar whole complement and whole complement that means and these are the outputs suppose this is one output this is second output and we have to first of all invert the output okay and then we have to use a three input in and get and we'll get this expression okay similarly if we see for f2 of a comma b comma c we'll have sum of one comma four okay so we can write it as one one means a bar b bar c a bar b bar c whole complement into this is four four means one zero zero that means a b bar c bar whole complement and whole complement so this is the second expression i have written this expression just comparing to these previous cases so f3 similarly f3 of a comma b comma c will have summation of 2 3 5 6 7 okay so we can write it as 2 2 means 0 1 0 okay that means a bar b c bar whole complement into 3 3 means a bar b c whole complement into 5 a b bar c whole complement then 6 a b c bar whole complement into at 7 a b c whole complement so in this way we have got the expressions for the uh, three functions f1 f2 and f3 now we will use a decoder circuit where we will use these inputs and draw the circuit diagram now let us draw a decoder circuit 3 into a decoder we have three inputs okay so let us draw a 3 into 8 line decoder 3 is to 8 decoder okay so here we have three input lines a b and c okay so this is nothing but 2 square this is 2 to the power 1 and this is 2 to the power 0 okay and we'll have eight outputs 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 okay these are the eight outputs this first output means zero means a bar b bar c bar okay this is a b this is a bar b bar c but here we can see that in each of these expressions this is f1 of a comma b comma c okay so in each expression we can see that we have a complement so we will use a nand gates okay sorted input nand gates in each of these gates so we'll get here a complemented output okay sorted input nand gate you'll get 
the output. In the first expression, we have a bar bc. a bar bc means 0, 1, 1, that is 3. Okay, so take a line from 3. Okay, then we have this is a b bar c, that means 5. So take a line from 5. Okay, then we have a b c bar, this is 6. Okay, so take a line from 6. So these three are the inputs of a NAND gate, three input NAND gate. Okay, this one multiplied by this one multiplied by this one and whole complement. Okay, so make a NAND gate here. Okay, and this three will be the input here. Okay, so here we'll go to the first function f1 of a comma b comma c. In the second case, we have 1 and 4, so a bar b bar c. This is 1. Okay, take a line from 1. Then, then 4. 4 means 4 complement. Okay, so here we have 4 complement. Okay, these two lines will be the inputs of a NAND gate. Okay, here. Okay, so here we'll get F2 of A comma B comma C. Okay, and in the last case we have 2, 3, 5, 6, 7. Okay, so we have already inverted it here. Okay, so take lines from 2. So draw a NAND gate. Okay, here we'll get F3 of A comma B comma C. First of all, draw a line from 2. Second one. Okay, take a line from 2 and give here a input then we have 3 3 means this line okay take a line from here and this is 3 okay then we have 5 fifth line here okay take a line from here and give input here okay 2 3 5 is done then 6 7 6 line is this one okay and 7 is this one so here we got the f3 of a b c so this is the circuit diagram with the given functions okay and using a 3 to 8 decoder so thank you for watching if you have any question please put it in the comment section below also like share and subscribe to my channel thank you